about today's video we will talk about what is O2 backwash filter as you can see guys this is for main engine fuel oil O2 backwash filter the purpose of this is to filter particles from media or heavy fuel oil in order to protect the downstream parts of the plant and to ensure that the fuel is clean enough before feeding into the engine the filter candles are clean automatically so that the plant does not have to be switched off for cleaning so this is voltage gauge type 6.72.1 slash dn80 the operational medium of this is heavy fuel oil the maximum working pressure is 16 bar the maximum operating temperature of this filter is 150 degrees centigrade and the back flashing medium of this is air the filter element type is star mesh type candles the absolute grade of filtration is 10 microns and the bypass filter element type is star plated element and the grade of filtration is 25 microns so this is the nameplate of the backwash filter um, as you can see guys we will familiarize our, ourselves this is the air vessel tank for the plant as you can see this is a solenoid valve for the air tank this is the air tank guys for the back flashing as you can see this part is the back flashing valve this is the back flashing valve and this is the steam outlet of the uh, heating for the warming and now this is the control of the backwash filter as you can see these are the accessories of the plant as you can see guys there are two chambers of the filter elements the one is standby and the other one is in service whenever it is flashes the other one should be ready for operation and that small bolt valve is the equalizing valve for both auto filter and bypass whenever you change over the valve you have to open first the equalizing valve and this one is the solenoid valve for air as you notice there are two manometer the inlet pressure and the outlet pressure of the fuel and it measures with the differential pressure so this is the bypass filter guys this is a change over valve as you can see this is the equalizing valve and now let's proceed right here it is the back flashing valve this part is the back flashing valve, valve in which every back flashes this valve opens and here it is and this is the differential pressure monitoring system that measures the differential pressures between the filter inlet and outlet the controller processes the electrical signals from the differential pressures monitoring systems and triggers a back flashing process when the set maximum value is reached in which the 0.6 bar it will trigger the back flashing the setting pressure of the differential pressure alarm is 0.6 bar and the other way of backflashing this is by timer 
it is back flashing in every one hour or you can set in every two hours based on the observation of your fuel oil performance so now as you can see guys now it is in force flashing there is a timer it is filling up the other chamber of the filter and the other one is changing over for service operation you can check also the pressure through manometer and now here is the control and you can manually back flash through this button control panel and as you can see guys and this is the changing over valve to which chamber is in service or to which chamber is in standby so this is the sequence control of the backwashing filter even though it is automatic filter it has to undergo a regular checks and maintenance based on your observation and based on the performance of the fuel oil whenever the plant gives so many differential pressure alarms and so many back flashes then it has to be cleaned and the recommendation for cleaning of the filter elements is the bull clean 2000 and that's all for this video guys i hope you learned something about the basic knowledge and the basic operation of this back flashing or the auto backwash filter of main engine so see you in my next video guys and i hope you don't forget to like share and subscribe if you are interested in this kind of topic and until here stay safe everyone this is jp23 vlog bye bye